Yeah, so just take me through every right. what you got here. Yes, yeah, so this is a raw beef case. So we got some 120 day dry aged beef and some 30 day beef. We got tri tip, ribeyes, New Yorks, kind of some of the nicer steaks. We got flank steaks, fajita strips, short ribs. For roast, we got chuck roast and cross rib roast. We got some fresh beef brockers, ground beef and stew meats. So you can get, you know, a pound or five pounds of ground beef and make some burgers. Meatloaf, and then we got our lamb and pork case. So we got some lamb stew meats, some shanks, some necks, all good for slow cooking, making stews or crock pot meals. We got some lamb lollipops, which are like the ribeye or the tomahawk of the lamb. And then we got pork as well. We got some tenderloins, loin roast, pork belly or side belly sliced up or side pork. And we got boneless pork chops, bone-in pork chops, fajita strips. We also got some roasts, so Boston butts and picnic roasts. Those are good slow cookers, making pulled pork or shredded pork, as well as some breakfast links. And then we also have our cured meat and smoked meat cooler, which has prosciutto, pomo, copa, pancetta, bronchale, all the cured pork products. And then we have some brisola, lamb prosciutto, lamb chorizo, panna rock pepperoni, so some salamis over there. And then our smoked meats on the bottom, we got two summer sausage, a regular beef, and a lamb huckleberry. We got beef pastrami, lamb bacon, pork bacon, pork jowl bacon, all sliced up, ready to go. So a bunch of smoked meats and cured meats. And yeah, behind the counter, we got some retail products, olive oil, vinegar, pasta, crackers, and all sorts of goodies. Wow, all right, thanks a lot. Yeah.